Well, hello, my YouTube family again. Now, this is the latest I have ever recorded, but it's, it's not a weekday. It's not a work day. And I am killing time between now and 10 o'clock when I have to watch um, Oprah. Where are they now? Um, I think she's going to be interviewing Hanson. Remember them way back in the way? Cute little boys. Um, yeah, I had not a, uh, well, I guess you could say a little semi-crush, but it was just the music really, because their music reminded me of the music I used to listen to back in my day. So, you know, there were certain songs that was like, oh, they were really catchy. And they brought me back to like when I was 13. So I really enjoyed some of their music, some of their music. I had, you know, a little crush. Yes, I did even go to a Hanson concert. I ain't gonna lie. I have no children, people, but I am a child. I will always be a child. The screaming was intense. I think I lost a little bit of hearing from that concert. Um, thankfully, nobody looked at me funny because I didn't have any children. And um, they were nothing but parents with little kids. <laughs> and I was like the only adult with no child. It was fun. I was reliving my youth. You cannot go back. You really cannot. No matter how much you try, you really cannot go back. You can remain young, but you cannot go back in time. You cannot rewind the tape. Oh, well, it was fun while it lasted. So, okay, this um, video is about the six Revlon color bursts that I have. And I really honestly thought I had more than six color bursts, but I have a lot of Revlon lipsticks. But I only have six Revlon Color Burst lipsticks. So let's get started because there's six and I am going to do swatches for six. So here we go, people. Okay. As you can see, I tried to, you know, tried to look a little bit more decent because I look back at the, the first one I did this morning. And I was like, Nancy, you could try at least a little bit. Okay. So I, you know, put my hair up in a little. It is what it is, people. It is what it is. Okay. So the first one, and I did do this in numerical order. The first one is 015, and this is grape. Now I can tell you right off the bat that this is True Sugar's fault. I ain't gonna lie. This one is True Sugar's fault. She was wearing it in one of her videos. I think she swatched it or whatever. And of course, I think she was taunting me. And um, you know you were, so don't even sit there lying. Um, she was taunting me, and of course, I had to go get it. So, you know, just by the name alone, great, you already know. I see it's got the Revlon embossed on it. See the name. Oh, hoity toity. So, that is grape. And I will do this is grape. A very purple, 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 purple. This is a purple, plum, purple, purple. So that is great. Okay. That's the first one. Second one is 030 Fuchsia. Y'all know this one because I wore this one rather recently. Going through my Fuchsia phase, people. Going through my Fuchsia phase. And I'm not done yet. No, I'm not done. That's Fuchsia. Right there. Gorgeous shade. There you go. That's fuchsia. That is fuchsia, people. That is number 030. Fuchsia. The next one is 050. Hazelnut. This is hazelnut, and it'll tell you what phase I was going through. Nude phase. Yes. This is hazelnut. And I think this is a my lips but better. Because you can barely see it. It's my it's pretty much my skin tone. So it's, you know, I don't know if it's exactly the the shade of my lips, but um it blends in rather nicely. And with a liner, the possibilities are endless. So that was hazelnut. Let me fix this one. Okay, the next one is 070 Soft Nude. Now, I'm almost kind of sorry I bought this one. I was going through my nude phase, but this one, I really have to work with this one because this is whoosha. 
yeah, this one's um my the, this one's the shade of my palm. I mean, you know, for real. Look at it, people. So it is rather a creamy, not a creamy creamy, but a creamy, very nudish shade. Very nudish shade. So that is soft nude. And I think with a with a you know a dark liner, I can tone it down a little. Maybe chestnut, who knows? I'll have to try that. The next one is 01, 090 True Red. 090 True Red. This was the red I thought, and I think maybe in some posters she was wearing it. Um, I forget the name of the actress. But if you look back in my previous videos when I did the review for this, it was because I saw it on the lips of the actress who was doing the campaign for this particular Revlon color burst. And I see her face as clear as day. Jennifer something? I forget her name. Anyway, I thought this was the one that she was wearing, so I ran out and bought it. But I think as it turns out, she was wearing the, the last one that I'm going to show you. But this is true red, and a true red it is, people. Look at it. You can't call it anything but a true red. And this is true red. Indeedy do. True red it is. I think her name is Jennifer something. <sighs> but I don't know. I don't remember. And the last one, which is the one I think she was really wearing in the campaign poster, is number 095 Crimson. 095, which is a shade darker than true red. It's like a garnet, like a ruby or a garnet shade. Crimson. It's a crimson shade. And you'll be able to see the difference. See, this is a bright red. That's true red, and this is crimson. It's a shade darker. And there you have it, people. Those are my six Color Burst lipsticks by Revlon. There you have it. So, see, I did do another video after all. Very proud of myself. I have been quite um busy today. I did dishes. I did, I should do vacuuming, but I'll do that tomorrow or the day after, whatever. Um, but I was I was kept rather busy because I had three loads, of, no, two loads of laundry, and I had dishes to do because I was cooking. And um, did the laundry, did, and it was a lot of everything. It was a lot of laundry. It was a lot of dishes. So I feel like I've accomplished a lot because I was doing a lot up and down the stairs with the, with the laundry. So I got my exercise that way. And, you know, I ate and I cooked. and So I'm feeling seriously, I, I, I'm not like tired, tired, but I feel like I've accomplished a lot. So I, I don't feel like I've wasted the day. You know what I mean? And um, I'm going to get a good night's rest because like you, like I told you earlier, um, it is a shopping spree to be done tomorrow. So with my girlfriend, Carrie. So there you have it, people. Those were my six Revlon Color Burst lipsticks. And as I was going through my lipstick um, collection to see what other collections I could do for you, I came across... Three more collections. I have my Sephora line collection. I have my Wet n Wild. And who knew I had so many? And I have my Maybelline Color Sensational lipsticks to go through. So you have three videos coming up. Don't ask me when. Because I know it's rather early. It's only 7.38 right now. But um, I'm probably just going to be doing some onlining right now. I don't feel like doing another video. This was like, I had enough energy to do this video. And I'm like, oh, okay, I think I'm done. And then I found that I have three other collections. And that is not meant, and that is, that's not the last of them. Because I still have miscellaneous lipsticks where I have like maybe two 
of something or one of something that that that's going to end it all. The miscellaneous lipsticks is the final, final collection of lipsticks that I'm going to do. So again, if y'all are keeping a tally, add these six, the color, color burst um, lipsticks to your tally. Let me know because I, like I said, I'm not keeping a tally of my own lipsticks. I just have lipsticks and I keep adding to the collection. So it's it's a mighty lot. That's all I know. It is a mighty lot of collections of, of lipsticks. And I'm, I'm proud of it. I'm not ashamed. I am not ashamed. The only thing you will not see me do because I will be do if, if I if I attempt to do my lip gloss collections, I will be doing um, those videos all of 2013. Not going to happen. Let's just say I have a lot of lip glosses. Okay, I have a lot. Because I told you the drawer don't close no more. Okay, so. Anyway, so that is that, people. Um, Yeah, my hair is coming apart. I should just, just be done with it. Just let it out, Nancy. Just let it out. And let it be free. Let it be free. Okay, so I just. Because I, I tried to, you know, try to cover up the ends and tuck the ends in. They ain't having it. So I'm just going to let it be free. Let it be free. Okay, that is it. That is it for now. Um, of course, you will see me again shortly. Uh, maybe not this evening. Who knows? I may have a burst of energy to do another video. You never know. It's not like I have to go to work tomorrow. Ha <laughs> ha. Or Tuesday. Ha <laughs> ha. So I'm very happy about that. To just know that this is a Sunday evening where I could just I could just do that. I could breathe because usually on Sunday evenings, my inner child starts to get cranky and at around a 10, 30, 11 o'clock, that's when I, the tantrum starts inside of me. I don't really throw a tantrum every Sunday, but I feel that inner child just going, no, 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 you know, throwing a tantrum. So, um, my inner child is quite content right now, quite content because there are two more days, two more. The four days are going rather quickly. I'm trying to slow the brakes, slow the brakes. But, you know, time is what it is. So it goes as fast as it does. And I was just trying to watch a movie with um, Hugh Jackman, Real Steel or something like that. I tried, people. I tried. But that is just one testosterone-filled movie. And it's about this man building a steel robot and it's got to go into a boxing ring or not for me no I, I really tried I figured Hugh Jackman you know easy on the eyes which he is that's a handsome man but um my attention span was kind of teetering and that's when I turned off the television and said you know what I think I could do a video so here you so there you have you could thank Hugh Jackman for that one um but I did watch a movie before Real Steel called Little Children. Ooh. That one was a little deep. It was intense. It was sad. And the characters in it were pathetic. So, but it was a really good movie. It was a really good movie. I, I think Kate Winslet and Jackie Earl Haley were both nominated for Oscars for that movie. It's called Little Children. And it is um, rated R, so the little children that you may have can't watch this. It's not for little children at all. Um, but it's an eye-opener. It's, you know, you just don't know who lives next door. That's all I have to say. If that, if that piques your interest as to what the movie is about, I suggest you watch it. Um, I had it on Free On Demand. So I didn't pay anything for it. It was free on demand. And um, I, I really watched it, not because I'm a Kate Winslet fan. I like her a lot. But I'm a Jackie Earl Haley fan because he played Kelly Leak in The Bad News Bears way back in the day. Brought me back to my childhood. Pretty much anything that he's in, I would kind of try to catch because, you know, he's, he's from my childhood. So, um, yeah. He was not Kelly Leak in this movie. Um, yeah, He was in Lincoln also, not Lincoln the Vampire Slayer. When I say I watched Lincoln, it was not the Vampire Slayer, okay? It was just 
Lincoln, okay, with Daniel Day Lewis. But Jackie Earl Haley had a little part in it. So, I, and I didn't even know because when I went to see the movie, I had no idea he was in it. And then he popped up. I was like, ooh, look at that. And let's just say I prefer to remember him in the part of Lincoln and not in the part that I just saw him play in. Okay? Because that part. Oof. -ah. Okay, but it's a very interesting movie. It is a very interesting movie. Like I said, you just never know who you live next door to. And just leave it at that. So on that note, people, that was my um, Color Burst lipstick collection. I hope you enjoyed that. Um, please fill me in. Let me know. And um, I will be talking to you soon. You know I will. Because I thought I was only going to do one video today. And boom, I wound up doing two. So you you never know. The, the night is still young. Okay? So you just never, ever know what I'm about to do. I just... I surprise myself when I do these videos, okay? When they are unscheduled and I just boom, just do a video, they are just, I surprise myself. All right, so I hope it's a pleasant surprise for you. You know I love you and I will be talking to you very, very soon, okay? Bye now.